In the previous video, we discovered what were some common or helpful keywords for using in our title and our description. And now that we have those keywords, what we want to do is also add them to our tags on YouTube, because that's going to help Google to know more that that's what this video is about. The way we got to the keywords that we wanted, though, is this video is about Dropbox that I made. So this is about how to share a Dropbox folder. And what I did to find what words I should use is I just typed in what it's about, Dropbox. Well, I got these words, Dropbox Tutorial, Dropbox Wishbone versus Google Drive. You could do a Dropbox Review, Dropbox versus Google Drive, and that would actually probably be a well-keyworded video here if you were able to make a video about that topic. So, but what we found out were some other kinds of words that are being used, app, office, tutorial. We end up finding out if we type in tutorial, people want Mac, Windows. Why well, didn't make a tutorial about Mac? And it wasn't done in 2013, but I did make a video using Windows 7 and it is kind of a tour and I do have some tips and tricks. So what I want to do is go add those kinds of keywords relevant to the video, of course, but I want to add those tags into my description or into my tags for this video. So where I do to go to do that is I go into info and settings underneath the video when I'm logged in and now I have words in here. You'll see I've got tutorial already in here, but some of those other words that we found out, office would be a good one, a YouTube, Google will make recommendations while you're in here. So there's Windows 7 operating system. We had the word app, but I already got app in there. Sharing. Remember, we had tips and tricks. And you could go on like this forever. I mean, we've got all kinds of things going on in this video. You're going to have to decide what are the most relevant keywords for your video. But once you've decided that, you want to include as many of them as you have time to put in for the video so that Google knows. And don't spam it because then you'll just be filling the internet with junk. You want to make sure that Google knows what this video is about and how to help bring the kind of searchers to your video so that they get exactly what they want if you've produced a high quality video for them. And that is what I would recommend to do to find out what tags are going to be relevant to your video is simply to type in the word of whatever your topic is about, whatever you've made a video about, and I could probably put the word review in there, even though this isn't a full-on review, I could put the word review in here, and I could also add the word office, but I've already got it in there, so I'll just add review. And that is what I would do to tag your video to find helpful tags, is just to type it in in the YouTube search. You can open a new window and do that there and then add them to your tags. My name is Jonathan Kraft. I made all of these YouTube videos about how to do things with YouTube videos on a web page. So go check them out. They are very interesting. And if you watch even half of them, you'll know more about embedding YouTube videos on web pages than anybody. Well, anybody who hasn't watched these videos. Enjoy. Seriously, check one of them out. I'll just I'll just wait here. Really, they're they're just right below. I'm just holding up my camera. Uh, seriously, just click on one of them, any of them. Really, pick one. They're all clickable. Just pick one, any of them. I'll just hang out. It's cool. I don't mind. If you liked this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up below. Be sure to subscribe as we have more helpful videos almost every single day. If you have any questions that we can answer for you, please be sure to come and visit us at showmehowtodothis.com.